Hello all traders. In this lesson of Module 9, Workshop 26, we will discuss the concept of macro structure and its related risks. You have learned in the previous modules how to find the best entry signal and profit target in the right location of the dynamic channel using 5 algorithm conditions. This profitable trading system based on one entry and one exit target should be practiced in the first year till the trader becomes consistent. When you gain more experience using the two structural and trading charts to identify the high probability trading areas under setup T. You may notice there are certain market conditions that you could gain larger profits and occasionally runners. We will discuss the topic of multiple exit strategies in the next workshop. But we'll focus in this lesson on the influence of macro market structures, and its related risks. Due to the fractal nature of the price, there are always market players with larger positions and profit expectations in the macro structural higher time frames, than your current structural chart. To see the market macro structure, you could use the same rule that you used 3 to 10 fold higher time frames of the trading chart to look at the structural chart. So again use a time frame 3 to 10 fold higher than the structural chart to have a glimpse of the macro structural market players. The dynamic channel of the macro structure will have three possible patterns of an uptrend, downtrend, or sideways. And when these three macro structure patterns are combined with the two structural and trading chart patterns, it can provide 27 possibilities. From all of these, 21 combinations are high risk and should not be traded. They will be filtered using the trading and structure charts as they do not pass the high probability trading area requirements based on the first three algorithms. The six other tradable scenarios can be categorized based on the macro structure into the three risk categories of very low risk, low risk, and medium risk. Under the very low risk category, the macro structure chart pattern could be an uptrend and the structural and trading chart pattern also shows an uptrend. The potential to reach larger gains increase significantly and you could adapt to an exit strategy that allows you to set multiple targets and have runners. You may see more high probability trading areas and have opportunities to add to contracts. Also under the very low risk category, the macro structure chart pattern could be a downtrend and the structural and trading chart also shows downtrend patterns. Again the potential to reach larger gains increase significantly and you could adapt to an exit strategy that allows you to set multiple targets and have runners. You may see more high probability trading areas and have opportunities to add to contracts. Under the low risk category, the macro structure chart pattern could be sideways and the structural and trading charts are aligned in an uptrend or downtrend patterns. The potential to reach medium gains exists if the range of macro structure sideways channels is wide enough to present tradable swings and you take position in the middle of the channel area. In this case, you could adapt to an exit strategy that allows you to set a limited number of targets, and with low expectations to catch runners. So only trade in the middle area of the wide range sideways patterns. and do not trade or add to your open positions when the sideways pattern range is narrow or the price is close to the dynamic support and resistance lines as the sideways pattern may break any time against you under the medium risk category the macro structure chart shows an uptrend pattern but the structural and trading chart show downtrend patterns or the macro structure chart shows a downtrend pattern but the structural and trading chart show uptrend patterns. The potential to reach profit is limited and you should adapt to an exit strategy that allows you to exit most positions at the first target or break even any open positions at the first target area, and have no expectation to catch runners. You may see very limited high probability trading areas 
and should lower your risk and not enter your open positions as the market can turn against your direction anytime. So, let's use real market data to update the dynamic channel of the macro structure and evaluate the risk and reward potentials under various scenarios when the structure and trading chart show high probability trading areas.